guys, it's your boy. So as you see, baby, or not, you will. We uh, we just left from picking up uh, one of our cars going to Texas. But guys, today we have got to talk. And I hope to God that this, this sticks with some people. This makes some people understand. Yeah, microphone I bought for the truck sounds worse than without it. It's junk. I'm trying. So, the, uh, like, this has got to stop, guys. This is an embarrassment to the industry. And I can say it's 100% hot shot car haulers with a wedge. I ran a wedge for three years. So guys, it can be done. You can run a wedge and not destroy property. You can run a wedge and not total your truck or the freight. You can do it, I promise you. It's not that hard. So, what, what's the problem, Hotshot? You never told none of us the problem. Well, the problem is all these wedges rolling over. All these wedges being put on their side because uh, whether you have a CDL or not, it doesn't matter. CDL guys are putting them on the side. And, and I know, I know. So I say, well, hot shot, everybody wrecks car, trucks. Every part has their own accidents. And I get it. You're right. How many of them do the same thing over and over and over? Dude, there's no way you guys that have wrecked your trucks didn't know that that was possible. Didn't know that that was coming because you're too lazy to move the cars. Guys, when I, even with a five car, when I drop, you've got to rearrange. You've got to get quick with it, quick with it. And you guys with three cars, you have zero excuse. Zero. Four straps, put it in reverse, put it in park, you're done. Strap it back up. That's a three minute job. Maybe six, because you've got two cars. You know, there's no reason for cars, or for trucks, to be running around with a truck and an SUV in the number one and the number two position. Because everybody thinks, oh, I'm Superman. It ain't going to happen to me. Guess what, Hoss? It can happen to you, and it will happen to you if you don't start caring. Six minutes of your life will affect the rest of your life financially. Because not only do you lose your business, most likely, because you don't have a truck, you don't have a trailer, now your CSA score's got an accident on it. God forbid if you hit somebody. God forbid if there's someone in your path when you roll over. Because I don't know if people know this or not, but doing harm to the elderly is just as bad as harming a kid anymore. Just as bad. Like, you steal from from me, it's uh, some kind of misdemeanor, right? Maybe a felony, depending on how much you steal. You do it to a somebody that's a senior, class B felony out the gate. Five dollars, class B. Don't believe me? Look it up. So, that may, I haven't looked this up, but I'm using my noodle, and it says, well, hot shot. They don't mess around with people harming the elderly. How many elderly do we got running around out here? Enough to wreck your day. If, if you happen to do something that involves one of them, you're done. And, and the kids are the same way, but the reason I say, the, I, I pick out the elderly, not that I'm picking on the elderly, but the elderly are usually the ones in the right lane you know, kind of going a little easy. And the wedges are the one in the left lane hammered down that are rolling onto the right lane. Who you gonna get? 
you know so guys there is absolutely zero zero excuse for this everybody knows and if you guys are watching this right now i'm asking you please 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 i barely ever ask you guys to do this please share this video out we need all these new guys coming in to see this do you know what this has done to the industry let me tell you so hotshot has been doing this four years four years right clean nbr uh yeah i may have a little a little nonsense but it's no moving violations there's no points nothing so i go to get an insurance quote car hauling almost thirty six thousand dollars it's a little high i said you know what what if I got it? Like, what if I didn't haul cars? What if I did power only, dry van, flatbed, step deck? What if I did any of those? He goes, oh, well, it may change. I said, all right, let's see what it does. Let's see what it does. $15,000 difference. 15 G's, y'all. So why on God's green earth is there a $15,000 premium to put cars on your trailer. Let me tell you why. Morons! I ain't never flipped a trailer. I've never had a damage claim. I've never had no problem with my cargo. But, you gotta pay the piper for everybody else screwing up. You know what I mean? So guys, we've got to We've got to get on top of this. We have to be responsible. We are a team out here. We're supposed to be helping each other. So let's help each other get the knowledge to know. To know. This can't be done. This shouldn't be done. This is easy to fix. Very easy to fix. I want you guys to put in the comments how many people really have problems figuring out their load arrangement. Like I'm trying to see if there if there's something I can do to help this. If if y'all can't don't know your weight distribution like you're supposed to because you're new and I get it, I will find a way to help. I will find a way to help. Um, there's an app out. My boy JC made it. Now that's not going to help this as much, but payload. Payload tells you the weights and all that of the cars. You know what I mean? So it, it was designed to tell you if you're going to be overweight. But if you pick that car, you know what I mean? Like you put that in there and it comes back. Seven, eight thousand pounds, but six thousand pounds. You know that car needs to be on the bottom. So I know that's for Android. I don't know about Apple. So if if you're having a little issue with finding weights, check out my boy's payload app. Um, that that's one way I can think to help with the weights. I mean, other than Google, I mean Google will one hundred percent tell you, but his app. Uh, has the Google in it. You know what I mean? I, I believe that's where he pulls his data from. But, guys, we've got to change this. And we've got to change this together. There's a way. There is a way to change it. We just got to work on it together. And there's definitely a way if there's a will and we all care about this. I don't know about you, but I, I kind of care about this industry. This industry feeds my family. This industry provides me a life that I would never and have never had before. So we need to protect this industry. And if it's if it takes us all babysitting and helping each other, let's do it. I mean, y'all, if I see them out here, I may, most likely, 
call them out on YouTube. Like, you don't want to be called out, don't get caught. I mean, I know. People don't care. That's okay. That's okay, too. But I care. And I'm going to see what I can do, along with all of you, to help save the industry. Now, that premium's not going to go down. You know what I mean? We've already got the bad name. It, if people don't save the money to pay claims out of pocket, then yes, at times you need to pay a claim out of pocket, guys. You have to. I mean, if it's a $1,500 claim and you have a $1,000 deductible, eat it. Eat it. Well, that's why I have insurance. Yeah, well, do you want it to go up 7000 a year for three years because you didn't want to spend an extra 500 Let's think about the long run, long run, fellas and fellas. I know I got some females up in here. So, guys, guys, let's do what we can do to stop this and stop it immediately. Please share this video out. Do not let these rollovers keep happening. Can't have it, guys. All right. If you guys have any questions, Hotshot Legend Gmail, holler at your boy. You want to go to hotshotdave.com you can get a consultation or the mentorship if uh you know teespring still got the hotshot gear but don't forget down in the description you've got victoria saving money the fuel you've got howard getting you quick money and you already know hotshot's teaching you to make money so we got the trifecta to keep the money in your pocket quick and in a hurry. Go ahead and give either of them a call if you're interested. But until then, like, share, subscribe. Get that ding ding. And I will see you tomorrow. Peace.